Mm. Welcome back to my channel, guys. Ignore my dragon. Welcome back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed, please leave a like and a subscribe. Today, 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 we are going to do none other than our Hellfire Roast Beef Burrito. Okay? So it was Hellfire Roast, seasoned with Hellfire Sauce. Roast in the oven, medium rare. I sliced it. Here we have it. So this is our inside round. Roast at medium rare, sliced. And now we're gonna turn this into a burrito. So we're gonna do a burrito with it. So here we have all of our condiments that goes with it. We got some purple onions. We got red, orange, yellow, and green bell peppers. We got some Cremini mushrooms, we got just some nice fine diced garlic with some julienne carrots. So if you notice, I kept it uniform. Everything is julienne and that's what we're gonna make it with us. We're making a burrito. So we're making a burrito, so you just wanna keep everything on strings, all right? So with that, we have some, some chiffonade spinach, chiffonade kale, and we're gonna saute that up also. We have some overnight rice, some white rice. This is Uncle Ben's. We're gonna add that also. Here we have our spices. So we have salt and pepper. We have some dry Cajun. We got some thyme, dry thyme leaves. And here we have the star of the day. I'm just kidding. But yeah, here we have none other than our Hellfire sauce slash marinade. Can use both ways. You can use as the direct table sauce. It can use as your marinade if you like spice. Because bear in mind, Hellfire has peppers in it. Seven different peppers, tropical blend. All right, so there we, we have it, the Hellfire sauce. There is no preservatives, no additives, 0% fat, iron, no calories, okay? Um, to kick things up, we got Kikoman going on. We got the olive oil, just get the grease going. And today, we're gonna make our burritos from none other than our baladi bread, you know? It's made in Canada. Don't know where it's from, but I like it, and this is what we're gonna use today. You know, um, here we have our Hellman's olive oil mayonnaise. So, uh, if you can think, right? Mayonnaise, egg, whites, and what's any sort of oil you want to use. So never think that mayonnaise is is uh, vegan. It's not. It's not vegan egg white food from animal so what I did I created a spicy mayo a hellfire mayo with, with, with my regular mayo I'm going to show you guys inside so I infused 5 tablespoons of hellfire inside the whole jar and the jar is about yeah, 890 ml so it's a 890 ml jar 5 tablespoons of hellfire Mm -mm 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 -mm. And now we have it. So that's gonna go on our our, our burrito. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get things going now. We're gonna get our vegetables sauteed, finish cooking up our beef. It's halfway there, and uh, let's do it. Let's get into it. Okay, guys. So we're back at the at the stove. We're at the range now. Not the shooting range. We're at the cooking range and we're gonna, just gonna grease that pan with some olive oil right and then in we're gonna go with our onions I'm gonna saute all that onion up okay there we go Saute all the onions. 
While we saute in that onion, we're just gonna season it lightly. Some that's some peppercorn, black pepper, and a little, just a little bit of salt. The rest is gonna go in after we add the beef. So we're just trying to release all that juice, that nice juice from the, the onion. Once you get that released. Gonna add some more, some more, uh, need some more heat. So you can speed things up. Cause I'm not a slow cooker, I know. I don't believe in slow cook. I leave the slow cook for the, for the, for the rookies. So in, we're gonna go with the beef. Okay guys, I'm just gonna, gonna break that down. Okay, so we're just gonna saute all that beef up. Yeah man, gonna saute all of that beef. And guess what? That garlic that you were saving, yeah, it's time for it to go. Yeah, oh yeah. Then, the rest of that pepper that you were saving, time for it to go. All that salt that you were saving, it's time for it to go too. <laughs> Guys, I spilled the salt, but fuck that. I rule the kitchen, the kitchen don't rule me. In with the Cajun. So you want all of that smoke, you know. So you start to season your beef way before it's cooked. And you got your seasoning your vegetables also. So in with your hellfire. And that was about a tablespoon and a half, guys. Be gentle. Remember, it's, it can get overpowering for the hellfire if you don't like spice okay be gentle wow look at that it's coming together eh oh yeah okay that looks good so the next thing you'll add to go cook with that is the carrots and the mushrooms right carrot and the mushroom and guys we're not making fried rice okay don't get it twisted this is not fried rice No, that looks good. That looks good. Oh yeah. So this this recipe was created by me. I was the one who came up with the idea. Um, the, 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 the roast beef was, it derived from my experience. Um, you can use any beef you want, but that was derived from my experience. Um, I have a, I have some secret ingredients that I'm gonna add that I can't tell you. Oh, 
boy, that looks good. So we're, we're, we're putting together our burrito, okay? Which is gonna be awesome. Can't wait for it to come, come afloat. Look at that. All right, so there you have it guys. So now you're gonna go in with your rice. And that was only like probably a cup and a half of rice. You don't need a lot. Yeah, you don't need a lot of rice. Okay, bear that in mind. Um, So you see that it's coming along right then once you once you put your rice in you're gonna hit that with some key command when I say hit it you just hit it lightly about two tablespoons oh yeah look at that coming along so you're gonna let that rice come aboard while you're doing that your 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 green leafy vegetables will be the last thing you you add you don't want to you don't want to lose any of this nutrient so right away we're gonna go ahead and add all the peppers Reggae. <laughs> All these colors just remind me of reggae. Yeah, man. You've been giving me so much trouble. Okay. All the trouble is going to be over now. Clean as you go, so it doesn't have, you don't have a lot of work to do when you're done. Wow, would you look at that? Okay, guys, so now you're gonna add all that smoke. All right. And along with that, you add your thyme leaves, dry thyme, herbs. And you just you just need all that green to fold inside. You know, once it, it folds inside, you did. 
Yeah, once you get it folded inside, that's it. Now, you need to go ahead and start rolling our burrito. You ready? Okay, let's go for it. Bam. Okay guys, so here we have it. Star of the day. So, first things first. You're gonna want to base the wrap. And just by doing that, you spread some Hellfire Mayo on the base of the wrap. Mm -hmm. Then, you want to add scoop out about that much about that much okay watch carefully guys watch carefully next on top you're gonna go Hellfire Mayo again. Okay. Then you're gonna fold. So to fold, you bring the sides up, then you roll that side, and then you get the perfect rollover. There you go. So that's one. That's one right there. And we're going to go with the next one. two beautiful wraps can't wait to get inside them so now I have my oven at 500 degrees heating up I'm just gonna tuck these in right away I'm gonna chuck them in and we're just gonna get them a little bit char on top at 500 char boil all right let's let's see how fast that takes all right so I'm just gonna take this out get it out my way that up top, put these on down here. So here we have it guys, the perfect Hellfire Roasted Beef Burrito. It's just the perfect, it's, it's so good. Like when I look at it, it has everything I would eat. All the veggies, all the, just look, just look, just look. You might be thinking I'm tripping, but look at that. Okay, so look at that. Just, 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 just wait for a minute. Just don't, don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Mmm. The spice is right. The herbs. The beef is just. Mmm, melting in my mouth. I toasted the 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 wrap, and wow, it's just crunchy. Mmm. Hey man, please like and leave a subscribe. Share if you have to. What you need to get into this, yeah.